Go up. Yes, that's right, because it would be at the top of the control tower. If we're in the gatehouse now, that's where we would need to go. Phew, we just made it. Is still happening. There's the sorceress. She's going into the gatehouse. Instructor, hit the switch now. Irving Kinius! I can't. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I always choke like this. I try to act all cool, joke around, but I just can't handle the pressure. Forget it, just shoot. My bullet, the sorceress, will go down in history. I changed the history of Galbaldia, of the world. It's all too much. Enough, just shoot! I can't, dang it! Irving, calm down. Everyone's waiting on you. I don't care if you miss. Whatever happens, just leave the rest to us. Just think of it as a signal. A sign for us to make our move. Just a signal. That's it. Please. Just a sign. I'm sorry. It's okay, your aim was perfect. Just leave the rest up to me. I'm going in for the sorceress. Irving Taylor, just be ready to back me up. Uh. <sighs> okay, everybody's got everybody's on board. Okay, everybody's got Let's go. Take care of Taylor. Oh, oh when did Squall learn how to drive? <laughs> That was quite a hard hit. <laughs> yeah, the size differences between the models of the of the, uh, the characters and what's in the display to the movies are a little off. And there's Caesar. All right, time for. End of disc one battles. Well, this is how it turned out. So you become the sorceress's lapdog. I prefer to be called her knight. This has always been my dream. Matthew, you're mine. Can you stop that? That's being recorded, son. Timing down. There we go. That's the time.
Ah, not bad. Thought I was dead, eh? Not to fulfill my dream. Okay, now's the time to actually heal. Wow, that was terrible healing. <laughs> I know I can heal better than that. <sighs> Still don't understand the, the random number generator of these healing. What in the world? This is not working at all. Like when I want it to, it doesn't work. But when I do, when I don't care, it works perfectly. <sighs> Let's just use a potion. Forget it. Oh, we're probably going to have to use a potion again. <sighs> yeah, this low-level run is really making it interesting to play. <laughs> for sure. So, these are the other a little bit than us compar comparatively, because he has Fira. Oh, we got him. I lost? Yeah, because you always suck. <laughs> You're losing it, Seifer. A seed. Planted in a rundown garden. Please tell me we're going to have backup. <laughs> Please tell me we're gonna have backup on this one. Hey, here we go, we got backup. I can fight if I'm with you. That's why I'm here. I have to redeem myself. Okay, what does she got? The accursed seed. The Daga? Woo! Dang! Oh! Uh. Doc? What does she got there in that mystery spell? Two Kira's! Okay, at least we have that to work with. chance we get we need absolutely need her buckle oh that, that's not gonna be too much yeah okay that did a fair about amount of damage to her buckle So, since she's primarily a spellcaster, her bungle is going to be amazing for us. Because she's going to cast Reflect on all of us. It's a good thing I pulled a weak one off. That also means we can't heal ourselves until the Reflect <laughs> wears off. So there's that too. But since Matthew's in a low power state, that's okay because we can continue to do things like we can. So now she's going to have to spend time doing Dispel for all of us of her next three turns. That should give us enough time to do much of damage to her. And a rough divide. Okay, so that's the spell on him. So Kukin. So all that she needs is to spell on Squall, then she'll be back to the spells. Then we're back in trouble. Whew, she has a lot of hit points. It's a cooking again. Let's keep doing it!
limit breaks really are the best thing in this game. <laughs> Get in seeds. Hey, we did it! We didn't even have to summon any more GFs after that point. 28B. Ooh, mid bag! Ooh, that's good. Shiva! Ifri! Siren! Oh, we gotta remember, we gotta select everybody's new skills the next chance we get. Oh, what's she doing? Now, you'll later find out in the game that uh, this is actually her limit break. So we had her on the run here for her to do this sort of attack, which really pretty much impaled Squall at this point. <laughs> so we almost had her on the ropes, but she did her limit break and well, down we went. So this would have been the end of disc one, uh, of the four discs that make up Final Fantasy VIII. Now obviously, remaster is just one full-on game, but we have a chance to save here, as we did in between discs. And now with Laguna, <laughs> at the start of the second disc. Uncle Laguna, there's someone here to see you. Huh, me? What's this person look like? He was wearing funny clothes. He's talking to Rain right now. Hmm. Is he at the pub? Yep, that's why I came over to get you, Uncle Luguna. Am I a good girl? No, you're not. It's dangerous to be out there by yourself. What if a monster comes and attacks you? It's only next door. It's okay. <sighs> Still dangerous. And since you're such a cute little girl, the monsters will especially be after you. They'll catch you and then they'll suck all your blood out. If anything like that should happen, Uncle Laguna's gonna cry. I'll be okay. I'll just call you Uncle Laguna. You'll come rescue me, right? Hey, alone! Wait! Alone? Hmm. Interesting name she has. Are those, like, bullet holes all throughout the side of the wall there? <laughs> Bunch of bullet holes in these walls? I waited. Am I a good girl? Yes, a good girl. Dear Alone's father and mother, Alone's been a good girl today. Right? Yep. And there she goes and run out again. She's bad again. <laughs> oh, let, do I have to talk to her? No? Okay. Ah! I'm in a battle. I did not know I was being in a battle. Oh no! Oh no! No, no, no! I am totally not ready. I was totally not ready. I am need to be healed. Uh, oh my gosh, because this is Squall that is replacing Laguna here. You think the Esther soldiers are really coming? That was two years ago, right? That would have been here. They would have been here by now. But you never know what a country ruled by sorcerers could be up to. Anyway, we go to the pub and fight that monster that we ran away from earlier, right? Draw. Draw some thunder. Yeah, but we only draw once per character on this, this run. Hello, now's your chance! To ants! <laughs> we had to make sure the coast was clear. You understand, alone? Now go to your room and play. I got in trouble. That's because you broke your promise. Too bad. Laguna used proper English when speaking to alone. I got in trouble. Too bad. <laughs> oh, these two get along so well together. Oh, hey, it's Kiros. He is the fun uncle. It's been a while, Laguna. Kiros? He's Uncle Laguna's friend. He dresses funny, but he's not a bad guy. Gotta go around, I guess. You seem well. Yeah, you too. 
mean, how long has it been? You know, our grand escape from Sintra. Uh, that was... one would usually call that being chased out. I thought so. Well, I would say about a year or so. I was bedridden for over six months. It seemed like every bone in my body was in pieces. I nursed him back to health. Thank you for taking good care of Laguna. I was able to recover in about a month or so. Ever since then, I've been searching for you. Why? After leaving the army, well, just killing time, I guess. Life's pretty boring without you as entertainment, my man. That's a harsh thing to say. I've been living a productive life here. <laughs> I think I understand what you mean, though. Hey, she's taking his side! <laughs> so what do you want to do now? What do you want to know? Let's see. What's been Ward up to? How's Ward doing? Ward quit the army, too. Luckily, he found a job, and he's working pretty hard. What's he doing? He's a janitor down at the D District Prison. Wow. Can't picture him mopping floors, but I'm glad he's doing well. Oh, and he never got his voice back. You could basically tell what he wants from his fa facial expressions. So what do you want to know? Uh, what about Julia? How's Julia doing? I don't know. You mean Julia the singer? That's right. Laguna really admired her and always frequent the nightclub. Shut up! So what if I did? Julia used to sing at a nightclub? No, she didn't sing. She just played the piano. And the first song she released was Eyes on Me? How does the song go? You don't know? Well, you never let me hear it. I didn't think you listened to music. The song's about being in love. I really like it. I heard she recently got married. Oh yeah, to some army general, right? General Caraway or something? We know that name. So Julia and Caraway are the mother and father of of uh, Taylor? Oh my goodness. I'm not too sure. I read in a magazine that her true love went off to war and never came back. General Caraway comforted her when she was feeling down. That's how they got to know each other. So she didn't wait for the soldier to come back. So what? Who cares? As long as she's happy, right? That's all that matters. Laguna's upset. <laughs> Ain't that right, Ellie? Right! Uncle Ra Laguna and Rain are... Ah! <laughs> okay, enough talk about this. <laughs> oh, where am I? I think the fairies are here. Fairies? Yeah, I guess so. And our work today should be a kinch. I'm looking forward to the battles. So what do you want to know? I think that's everything. Let's talk later. Time to do some work. Okay. So what's your plan? You're going to stick around here for a bit, right? Would that be okay? You work for what you eat. If that's fine with you, you're more than welcome. 